well we've had a bit of a social media break over the last couple of weeks I have to say with us finishing off the kitchen and we're completely moved in now which is excellent and I will have to do a tour of that it's not finished yet but it's definitely finished for Christmas and I'll do a tour of that another day so I'm back I've been recording a few little snippets over the last couple of weeks here and there when I've had chance in amongst everything else so I'm going to insert those here and do a little I don't know, a montage, is that what it would be called? Uh, of all the little bits and bobs of what's been happening over the last couple of weeks. And then we're back to our regular Vlogmas recording tomorrow.
Good morning, it is December 14th today and I've been kind of AWOL from vlogging for the last week from Vlogmas. We've basically spent the whole week painting and grouting floors day after day and trying to get the kitchen ready enough to be able to move in. We're planning on today being moving in day, we moved some things across, we've moving some more things over today and hopefully that'll be us in this evening by tea time. All being well, although we might be living off pot noodles if everything's not sorted out properly by the end by tea time. Um, so yeah, we're just going to crack on with that today. Hopefully get a bit of uh, crafting, like knitting time in between. But otherwise that's our main focus. And then once we're in there, I mean it's not finished, completely finished, but it's finished enough to actually move into there. And then we can finish off the rest of it after Christmas because it's too close to Christmas now. We can't do anything up until now and not been able to bake any cookies, not been able to do any mince pies, nothing like that because we just haven't been able to use it yet. So once we're in, I can use it over Christmas and then start up afresh after the new year, uh, finish off the last bits. So there's a few more tiles need to go down under the worktops and the cupboards, but we're gonna. John's going to build some frames to hold the worktops temporarily over the Christmas period and then after Christmas he can build proper unit, base units and get those in but we need to put a few couple more tiles down around the edges uh, and they'll be done and what else and in the pantry as well so there's still bits to do um, patio doors need to go or French doors need to go on that can wait till after Christmas as well now so yep that's our plan so far for today. Well we've already got through to five o'clock in the evening and I still haven't done any knitting but we're nearly in the kitchen. John's finishing the plumbing tonight and I am off out because it's our last roller derby skit session of the year till mid-January I think it's the first one back. So we're having a fun night we've got mince pies planned and party games on skates we're also supposed to be doing something called strip the willow on skates or Cadian style. Now, if you don't know, Strip the Willow is like a folk, kind of like a folk country dance. Um, you know, there's two rows of partners and you meet in the middle and spin around and then you spin with the next one up the line, spin with your own partner and spin the next one up the line and so on and so forth. Normally, you do that all the way at the top and then the next couple will start up the line, up the, the double line. Uh, or Cadian style, it's slightly different. Every few partners up the row, um, there will be another set of partners doing the same thing. So not just one set going up the line, there'll be several. And we're going to be doing this on skates. I've never done Strip the Willow. This is going to be dangerous, but hilarious and fun. And we've got a Bad Secret Santa gift giving tonight, which is basically means it's a Secret Santa, but we have a really strict budget of... £2.99 and we're looking for the cheesiest gifts possible which Bad Santa will be delivering to everyone tonight or tomorrow at our set our night out tomorrow night for Roller Derby. So I have my uh, Christmas leggings on which I will show you in a sec and I'm just about ready to go out and head into town the weather's pretty windy and uh, maybe I'll get some footage tonight depends because you know everybody wants to be on the internet so we'll see what I can do. Christmas leggings, dug them back out, bought these for Roller Derby last Christmas. <laughs> 